Today we're going to demonstrate the new and improved Affinity Merge. Affinity Merge allows you to send files directly from Capture One into Affinity Photo. You can send them to a Focus Merge, HDR Merge, Panorama, or Stack Document. The new version also allows you to create intermediate RGB files. This allows you to bake in any adjustments that you've made in Capture One into the intermediate RGB files that get sent to Affinity Photo. The intermediate RGB files are 16-bit Adobe RGB full resolution TIFF files. Once the intermediate RGB files have been created, Affinity Merge opens Affinity Photo, creates a new document of the type that you specified, and populates the file list with the intermediate RGB files. If you chose to skip creating intermediate RGB files, then the original raw files selected in Capture One would be added to the file list. Once the file list has been populated, you can complete the merge. Back in Capture One, you will notice, if you're running from a catalog, that the intermediate RGB files have also been imported back into your catalog for you. In addition, if you started Affinity Merge from a user album, you will also notice that the intermediate RGB files have also been added to that user collection. The intermediate RGB files are always deposited in the same folder as their original RAW file. If you're working from a session, this means that the intermediate RGB files will be visible in the same folder as the original RAW files. All folders in sessions are hot folders, therefore there's no need to import them.